Levy was outside playing when something in the sky caught his attention. A spaceship? He wondered. The spaceship came closer, landing on the grass. Levy watched as a door opened. Out climbed an alien. No, a spaceman. No, what was it? A space dog? Asked Levy in complete surprise. Greetings, said the space dog. I'm here to study your planet. Take me to your leader. Which leader? Asked Levy. My mom, my dad, teacher, coach, school principal. Hmm, said the space dog. I didn't know Martians had so many leaders. I'm not a Martian, said Levy. I'm Levy, an Earthling. Who are you? An Earthling、I'm、space asked dog. The space dog. Said, hmm, said the space dog. I didn't know Martians had so many leaders. I'm not a Martian, said Levy. I'm Levy, an Earthling. Who are you? An Earthling asked the space dog, scratching his ear. Perhaps I have miscalculated. I'm space dog, said the space dog. Wow, a real live space dog! I love space! Exclaimed Levy. What does a boy know about space? Asked space dog. It's dark, isn't it? Replied Levy. That's a start," said Space Dog. "Space is dark. There is no air to reflect light, and without air, there is no sound. Space is completely silent." Whoa! Replied Levy. Even if I screamed, nobody could hear me. And. Space is cold," said Space Dog. "Without a spacesuit, you would freeze out there. Also, there's no food or water, and there's no gravity, so everything just floats around." Wow," said Levy. "How could people even live in space? No one could live in space." Without a spaceship or a space station, Space Dog continued. I want to explore space. Can you take me with you, Space Dog? Asked Levy. Sure, said Space Dog. But first, I need to eat something. Can you spare me some food? Yes, follow me, replied Levy, excitedly taking Space Dog to the kitchen. He could not wait to go explore space.